Stop! And oh my god, those fucking car alarms, they keep going off. Jesus Christ, if you can hear that. Jesus Christ, it's so annoying. Uh, every time I try to record, I kept getting interrupted by stupid car alarms. I don't care if you're getting robbed. I'm trying to record my Wind Waker. Jesus Christ. Okay, anyway, um... Stop, anyway. Oh my god, the car alarms are back! Uh, oh, anyway, stop, anyway. Welcome back to more Let's Play. The Legend of Helga. Hey, Arnold. I don't even know anymore. I'm tired of these puns. This stupid car alarm. Jesus Christ. Alright, are they done? No, they're not done. Of course they're not done. Anyway, um, we're back here at the Earth Temple. Um, as you can see, there's another puzzle here. We're supposed to use um, those black chews and turn them into statues. With that, we could shine some light using the fire arrows on these curtains. One of these, I believe, has... Oh, the chew bastards! Leave me alone, you rapist chewies! Alright, um... Ice isn't gonna do shit to them, but whatever. Ah, get away from me, you ho! Damn it! Leave me alone! I'm trying to shoot fire at your face. Alright. And I think the car alarm has ended. God damn it! It started again! As soon as I say that, the car alarm begins. Alright, let me be quiet for a second. Maybe you'll hear it. Well, you probably won't because of the game audio, but... I'll try anyway. You guys have to hear that. I mean, it's so loud. I live, like, really high up from the ground, and it's kind of a miracle that I hear that. Um... Considering I live in New York and I live in a really tall building, <laughs> you can kind of imagine. Um, with that, oh crap, Medley's about to get hurt. I think if she gets hurt, it yep, yeah, it cancels out the um, command Medley. Bam! Leave me alone, Chew Jelly. Let me just kill the green one. Anyway, with that, we can place one on here. Oh crap, it's turning back to normal. And I, I know a trick. Wait, Medley, if I call her, yep, she'll t <laughs> the Chew will turn back to normal. With that, I'll pick that one. Oh, no. Oh, no, 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 you don't. Hey, Medley. Haha, -ha, suckers. And bam. With that, I can grab Medley, and we can make a break for the staircase before they end up done. Okay, the car alarm is gone. I'm very happy now. <laughs> anyway, I'm sorry about that very rude intro, um, you know, beginning of me. How you guys doing? How's your Wednesday? Uh, my Wednesday um, hasn't arrived yet because it's Sunday when I'm recording this. But um, besides that, it's all good. I usually spend my time on Minecraft or on Tumblr, so I've kind of been. Oh no, Floor Masters. Oh no. These things are horrifying. Holy. Oh god! Ah! If they grab you, they'll drag you back to the beginning. Oh god, leave me alone, 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 If they grab you, they will drag you up, and you're gonna have to start the dungeon back from the main room, and you don't wanna do that. Oh man. But trust me, um, they, they can also grab Medley, which is not good at all. Uh, cause then you're gonna have to go all the way back and pick her up and then come all the way back to the room. Hopefully I don't get captured by a floor master. Suck my penis. I'm sorry if you're a bottle of water, I'm kinda, you know, thirsty, so. Ah, Poland Spring. Also, if you see, like, those, um, little yellow spinny symbols on walls, you can, you can reflect light off them and they will be destroyed. And usually it leads to a hidden room or a hidden item or anything. And with that, uh, there's another thing on the wall. Let's see if I can get that. Um... Sweet, it's another pot. And with that, we can uh, actually teleport to the... Come on. Come on, Medley. Let... Come. God. Uh, come on. Let... Hey. 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 Go... Damn it. Uh, you know what? Fuck it. Just let me get this elephant one and... There we go. God damn it, Medley. It's kind of awkward trying to hold this, but... um. Very stiff, if anything. It's kind of like a rubber band. Well, stiff like a rubber band. That makes sense, Wing. That totally makes sense. Ah, water. Alright. You able to push this block over here? I think it does something. Yes, it does. Hidden treasure chest. And I think inside of that is the compass. So, let us go achieve that. And uh, you pull this block over here so you can get over there to the higher platform. Alright. Uh, in other news, I... Still been watching The Legend of Korra for any uh, Korra fans out there. Holy shit! The episode 8, uh, when Extreme meets. I Extreme. I don't remember what the episode was called. It's the one with Tarlock and Korra. And if you've seen the episode, you know what I'm talking about. <laughs> that episode is absolutely my favorite in the series so far. It's hilarious. It's full of action. 
holy cr especially the beginning with uh, I Iki and um, Korra and uh, Asami when they're walking down the hallway to get her to her room and she says something and her face her fucking face I'm actually gonna put a gif up right now because how hilarious that was everyone should see this face at least once in their life because holy crap that was funny as balls <laughs> um, we got the compass Wing, do not worry about straying away from Medley in the depths of the temple. Just relax and open your dungeon map as long as you have the compass, you can easily confirm her whereabouts. Alright, so anytime we lose her, we can use the compass to find out where she is, which is actually pretty nice. Because I feel like I'm going to lose her a lot in this dungeon. Oh, more moblins, let me put you down. And Oh, don't set her on fire, that's my bitch, you don't set my bitches on fire. Bam oh, crap. And there's a new enemy in this room. Um, I don't. I never know official names of enemies. I just, you know, Phantom Lantern. That's what I'm gonna call it. the Phantom Lantern. Danny Phantom. -na 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 -na. That was a pretty good show back when. I, back when I was a kid, that show was really freaking awesome. Um, maybe you, most of you are still kids, I'm assuming, and you're probably watching shows like Young Justice and stuff. Um, I've never seen the show, and I've heard really good things about it though. But holy crap, uh, also, if you, when you break down the lantern, this thing kind of possesses you and makes your controls all backwards. Which is not cool. Don't go into the next one, Link, you bitch. Okay. And as you can see, I'm in purple and all my controls are backwards, so. I look so derp. Holy crap. Ugh. And he's gone. Funny thing is, that's how you defeat the enemy. You kind of have to throw yourself into them and the car alarm has returned. The car alarm has returned! Ah! No! Alright, anyway, um, it's not as loud. Maybe it's another car? Hopefully, oh, medley, I'm sorry. Let me try that again. And with that, we're able to destroy that, and there's a hidden treasure chest. I think, um, mostly when you see hidden treasure chests inside of dungeons, it's usually a joy pendant or rupees. That's my best bet. It can't be anything important like a small key, because I highly doubt that. Um, but something as important as that. Let's see, anyway. Uh, skull necklaces. They're useful for a side quest. I don't remember what it was, but everything eventually is useful. <laughs> and inside, my money is on rupees! Is the price right? No, it's not. It was a joy pendant. I was kind of right. But joy pendants, like I said, are very, very useful later in the game for story progression. Um, so collect as much as you possibly can. And anyway, medley, let's go, go, go. And up here, I think, is a boss room. But we can't open that yet. I'm going to have to go in here first. And if I remember this room, yep, I remember this room. This room is probably the scariest thing in the game. This dungeon is scary overall because this introduces these enemies. Oh my god, these are the freaking bane of my ex Oh, small key. Um, okay. Usually he puts his hand up and oh god, oh god. Ah! Alright, no, but really just... Oh, those are so scary. Just They scream and petrify you and... Oh, haha, your scream didn't work on me now, you dirty bitch. Now you're going to die. And I remember there's one more. Yep, there's one more. Um Oh god. Alright, um these things, yeah, they happen to rape you if you don't um like move away in time. But anyway, we completed like kill all of them. Oh my god, those things are I think those are scarier than the what are, what are they called? Something deads, re-deads? I think that's what they're called. From Ocarina of Time, the zombies things that kind of molest you. I think those are scarier because their eyes are red and they glow when it's... Ugh. Anyway, here's a room that we can't take medley in for some reason. Well, that'll be revealed in a second. I love the mini boss music. Holy crap, this is amazing. Anyway... Shoot an ice arrow on your face, and while that he's done, bam, bam, get a good combo off of you, bam! Oh, and I just got bitch slapped by the hammer. Another ice arrow, and while his head is down, uh, he will regenerate if you don't get enough shots on his head. But bam, I ended up killing you anyway, bitch. 
you're my slutty hoe. You're my. Here's more skeletons. More skeletons. I said, hello. You're dead. What do you want? Go, go, go. Get out, 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 get out. Get out. Come on, I'm in a little corner right now. <laughs> yeah, remember I told you how I hate when people walk in on me when I'm recording? Um, yeah, my dad just walked in. Uh, looked at me awkwardly because I was in the middle of singing because <laughs> um anyway my family Let's see. and I was kind of singing to him to get out that's that's gonna be an awkward conversation later <laughs> anyway we're done with the mini boss it was just three of those skeleton guys and uh, we got a bunch of cool equipment here not really any rupees I would like some rupees considering I have like the biggest wallet and I haven't really been filling it up but anyway inside we get Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, I wonder what it is. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. We got the mirror shield. Yes, with this we are able to reflect light, which is really awesome. Now we basically have the item metally does, except it's in the form of a shield. And you see we have it equipped automatically. Our old shield is like really artificial now. We don't really have to use it anymore. But with that, you see we can reflect light and it points it at that and... The door opens and the room illuminates itself. There we go. And I think now that I have collected the mirror shield, I am going to end this episode off. Where's Medley? Please don't tell me she went far away. Medley, where'd you go? Anyway, comment, like, subscribe, stay awesome.